part of the body workout. Today we got two circuits just like last time. 20 seconds work, 10 seconds rest. We're gonna do a narrow squat today. So just legs close, an overhead dumbbell press, and a skater side to side, and a sumo pulse. So you're gonna want a set of dumbbells if you have them. You can use soup cans, you can use anything you find around the house that has a little bit of weight to it, or just do it without weight, okay? And a stability ball is for our next circuit. We won't need that on the first round. I'm gonna start my time right here on my watch, so you just have to follow along. You don't have to worry about the time. And let's get to it. Grab your dumbbells. Keep your belly tucked, your shoulders back, your chest lifted. I'm gonna start my time right here. Oh darn, hold on, I messed it up again. This is actually take two, I tried a video earlier and I had my watch right and now I've done it wrong. Give me a second. Okay, now we're good. You ready for that narrow squat? Sorry for the delay. Timer's going, here we go. Shoulders back, chest lifted, core tight, sit back and down, stand tall. Inhale, exhale. Good, so the weight stays in your heels, your belly tucks, your hips go back, your chest stays lifted, we're almost there, and that's it. Now we're gonna bring those dumbbells right here, shoulder height, your chest stays open, you stay tall, use that good posture, soft in the knees, we're gonna press the weights right overhead, exhaling up, let the belly come up and in, so, so that those abs hug into the spine, support in the back. Exhale. Good. You can alternate this if you need to, or you can put the weights down if they start to get too heavy. But you're strong, you got it. Now we're gonna throw down those weights and we're gonna do that skater side to side, okay? You can do this as a step touch. Our right, time's going, so let's go. You can keep it here or you can do a step touch side to side. All right, but try to make it as big and fast as you can, because remember, that's what these Tabata workouts are about. It's about going 20 seconds really hard, and then you get your rest. So let that heart rate come up. Good. All right, grab one dumbbell or two or no dumbbells. We're going to do a sumo squat, so the legs are wide. Toes are at the angle out. You sit back and down, this little pulse here at the bottom. Core is tight, chest stays lifted, knees are behind the toes, hips are back. If you need to take a break, you can take a short one, but then come right back, okay? Don't quit, you got it. This is gonna be the toughest one. Almost there, good. All right, let's do it again. Narrow squat. Shoulders back, chest lifted, core tight, weights right here by the side. <laughs> Sit back and down. I've got my tall son, King, videoing today. He has no commentary. <laughs> All right, good squat, sit back and down. Exhale up, squeeze in your glutes at the top. Shoulder press, get ready. Keep the core tight, keep the knees soft. Press into the ceiling, to the sky. Exhale, time started, 20 seconds. there. Great. All right, that skater now side to side. A little bit of cardio work. Make it big, make it fast. It's our last time to do this one. Let's go. Side to side. Big arms, big feet, big jump. Almost there. Sumo squat with the pulse, okay? So you're holding that weight right here at your chest. Legs wide, toes at the angle. Get the hips back and down. Let's go, 20 seconds. Now, if you have to take that extra rest break, take it. It's okay, just come right back. Not a fail if you have to take an extra rest. You just always have to keep showing up again, okay? Keep coming back. Almost there. Good. All right, done with 
to bottom one. One minute rest here while I explain the next one. We're gonna get our stability ball and we're gonna get our dumbbells. We're gonna do a rear delt raise on our stability ball. Real rear delts back of the shoulder. You're gonna put your weights on either side of your ball. You're gonna come so you're in a plank position on the ball. Your chest is on the ball. Your legs are lifted, your core is tight. Now, if you need to, you can keep your knees on the ground. That's fine, okay? But here, we've got our arms hugging the ball, and then we're gonna lift with the back of our shoulder. Now, you can do this both arms. You can do it one arm and then the other, so you can alternate. And if you don't have a ball, you can just come here in this bent position and lift, okay? The ball actually just makes it a little bit easier because you have some good back support, but you also get a little, little bit more core, okay? So here we go, everybody in position. I'm gonna start my timer back. Four, three, two, and let's go. Lift them with the back of the shoulders, exhaling up. And even though the belly's resting on the ball, the core is still tight, that core is still engaged. And give it that exhale. Squeeze right between the shoulder blades. Almost there, good. Now, still using our ball, we're gonna flip over and sit on it, okay? Make a nice, easy transition, don't rush, okay? When you start rushing around with the ball, it starts throwing you to the floor. Right here, lat raise. You can alternate this, one arm and then the other, or both arms lifting. Exhale. And think about your posture. You sitting not nice and tall. Good. All right. Take it back to standing. Roll those shoulders back, chest lifted. Bring those weights right here. We're going to do an Arnold press, okay? Now let's alternate. Let's do one arm and then the other, okay? So exhale and exhale. If you're thinking this isn't too bad, Take it onto a both arms lifting. Exhale up and down. You'll notice that weight's rotating and rotating, okay? So the palms facing the shoulders at the beginning. All right, are you ready for this? I didn't give you any warning. We're doing a burpee, all right? I'm not gonna do the push up in the burpee, just the burpee, time started. So hands down, back, in, and up, all right? If that's way too much, Take it down, step it back, step it in. Up. No jumping required right there, okay? So pick your level. Good, all right, we've done it once, we can do it again. I'll tuck my necklace so I don't lose a tooth. Grab those weights, grab your ball. Let's go, time for that stability ball, rear delt raise. Exhale, lift it up. Core is tight. Your heart rate should really be up on this circuit. It's a tough one. Good. All right, let's take a rest. Make your smooth transition to, seat, to seated on the ball. Sit up tall, shoulders back, chest lifted. Oh, we're doing a lat raise. Exhale, out to the side. So you got that nice straight line through your back, top of the head, reach into the ceiling. Do one arm and then the other if you need to alternate. Good, all right, for that Arnold press now. Arnold Schwarzenegger move. Nice and strong, you're strong, you got it. Let's press both arms or alternate. Exhale, exhale. You can even mix it up. You can do one, one on the other, and then both arms. Press. You got it. It's our last time. All right, great. You ready for that burpee? Now that you're over the shock and awe, you can do it, okay? Walk it if you need to. Work up to those jumps. Start adding them in. Let's go. Down, back, in, and up. Remember, walk if you need to. And up. Down, back, in, and up. Just a few more seconds. This is the big finish right here. Good, we did it. 
All right, great job. Come back and remember to subscribe so you don't miss the videos. All right, we'll do it again. Bye.